Hello, I'm Bernard Hickey from interest.co.nz and welcome to 90 at 9, brought to you in association with ASB Bank. This is our morning briefing where you get everything you need to know in 90 seconds at 9 o'clock, starting now with news just in from the US Federal Reserve that it has cut its version of the official cash rate, the US Federal Funds Rate, by 0.5% to 1%. This was slightly less than some people had expected on Wall Street and the Dow is actually down sharply now because of that. The, the Fed is obviously trying to reduce the damage from a sharp recession in the United States and so are other central banks. China overnight cut its official cash rate for the third time in a month. There's also all sorts of drama in Eastern Europe where in Hungary it has just agreed a $25 billion bailout package with the International Monetary Fund and also the European Central Bank because of heavy foreign borrowing in the last couple of years and the turmoil on global markets. Now back closer to home, we've got an interesting forecast from an economist at JP Morgan. JP Morgan is now forecasting the official cash rate in New Zealand will drop to 3.25% by the end of next year. It is saying the global economy will slow much faster than expected, that the Australian economy will slow and therefore the New Zealand economy will slow and give the Reserve Bank the room and the need to cut the official cash rate from currently at 6.5% to 3.25%. This is quite a bit lower than most people expected. If we get an official cash rate at 3.25%, you'd expect variable rate mortgages to be closer to 5 maybe 6% and look quite attractive versus fixed rate mortgages, but maybe not till sometime next year. I'm Bernard Hickey. That was 90 at 9 brought to you in association with ASB. Music.